Hello everybody and welcome to Technology Lab. In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to install Windows Server 2008 Release 2 on VMware Workstation. The first thing what you need to do is you need to download and install the VMware Workstation. So this is the link from where you can download the VMware Workstation. I'll place this link in the description of the video. Once you have downloaded this, just double click on the executable and follow the on-screen instructions to install VMware Workstation. Once you have installed the VMware Workstation, you'll get a desktop icon like this one. Just double click to it and open. And one another thing, you need to have an ISO for the Windows Server 2008 along with the key. So once you have all these things, just click on create new virtual machine. Click next. And if you have a disk, just select the disk and set the disk into your drive and select the disk installer or else if you have an ISO just select the second option and go to the path where you have this executable and just click open click next enter the product key enter a user ID and a password for that Please note that this password will not work for the administrator account. So you need to log in into the administrator and create a new account for that. Just click next. This is the name of the virtual machine and this is the location where you want to keep the files of this virtual machine. So leave this as default and click next. Here this is the size of the hard disk which you want to allocate to your virtual machine. So I'll leave this as it is. If you want you can increase this. Leave this option as it is and click next and click on finish. So once you click on finish, your Windows Server installation will start. Let's wait till it is initialized. So I'll maximize this. So here you can see the installation starting. So your Windows Server 2008 installation is started. Let's wait till the installation is completed. You don't need to do anything. Just sit back and let the installation finish. Once your installation is finished, it will reboot. So the installation is finished successfully. Minimize this. So this finishes the installation of the Windows Server 2008 on VMware Workstation. So after the installation is finished, it will install some VMware tools. So let this complete and then you can use your Windows Server 2008. So in this way, this finishes the installation. I hope this has been informative for you and I'd like to thank you for viewing. Please feel free to comment on the video if you have any doubts. Once again, thanks for watching.